let's uh let's get into it um all right teleforum walter martin's teleforum play oh uh all right juliana um okay this is the right building hey you got that camera on uh on now yeah it's best to have as much material as possible we can edit it all later we want the sixth floor can you get the button all right juliana all right we'll get the button sixth floor right here boom um Oh, what do we got? Six, five, four, three, two, one, T. Al. Alum. Alum. Talum. Okay, uh, I don't know what those are, but we 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 want floor six. So we're 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 fucking good with floor six. Let's uh, go right there. I don't know what T, L, and M are. What is it? You look like you have something to say. Uh, let's see. Don't you think it's wrong to bother a widow? I was just thinking about what happened. Wait, what, what happened? Did you get authorization for this? All right. Uh, don't you think it's wrong to bother a widow, Juliana? If we don't do this, someone else will. You know Augusto back at the station? He's itching to make a special show about this. Trust me, new guy. I didn't get here waiting for them to give me the jobs. It was bizarre. You didn't see it, did you? Uh, they just told me how it happened. What he used to... You know. You're lucky. I wish I hadn't seen it. Fucking seen what? The hell are we talking about here? Uh, dot, dot, dot. You heard it, right? He gave Kelso a v VHS tape. The VT operator? Right. Kelso was supposed to broadcast the tape, but he couldn't. Technical issues. Then, bam, it happened. Oh, we're here. Come on. Okay. Oh, okay. We're going to apartment 608. Easy to remember. Okay, so uh, so so we're going to visit a widow. We're part of a news crew, uh, and then something else also happened that relates to a VHS tape that someone was trying to broadcast but could not because of technical difficulties. Uh, don't know what that's about, but. I'm assuming we'll we'll find out later. All right. Uh, let's see. We got go to the light side. Head towards the trash bags. All right. Let, let's go to the light side. The happy side. I don't think it's this way. Oh. Uh, let's see. I think we can get a nice take by the window, or let's head back then. Uh, yeah. I think we can get a nice take by the window. Hmm, you're right. You have a good eye. All right. Someone's been coming here for a smoke. See the ashtray? Don't show me that. I haven't touched nicotine in three years. Absolutely same.
Come on, let's head down the corridor. Oh, there it is, 608. I think it's that apartment just ahead. Here we are. Uh, dot, dot, dot. Well, let's get ready, shall we? You can film her getting the door and all that. So, should I knock on the door, ring the bell? What'll look better on the video? Oh, um... Oh, shit. I don't know. Um... Oh, alright. I guess we'll knock. Oh, uh, let's see. I wonder if she's up to talking to strangers right now, or I hope the camera doesn't act up during the interview. Alright, okay. I wonder if she's up to talking to strangers right now. If she isn't, she will be now. What does that mean, Juliana? Jesus. Let me try again. Let's see, is she even home? Uh, say, did you work with Walter for... Who the fuck is Walter? Uh, what if she won't see us? Hmm, I don't know. Uh, is she even home? Uh, Fer Ferrera called her right after it happened. I doubt she's left the house since yesterday. All right, third time's the charm. Oh, Adriana. Oh, what do you want? Hi, Mrs. Martins. We're from Channel 8. We came to give you our condolences. Do you really need a video camera for that? We're making a special program about Walter. Uh, homage. A kind of retrospective, you see. He worked at the station for so long. So we wanted to talk to you about him. About what happened. Right. Fine, come in. It might be good to talk about it. All right, uh, let's see. Our options are quick thinker, huh? Homage, or I can't believe she. I can't believe she bought that. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. All right. Homage? Why not? We can edit it later. Right now, we need the raw material. Come on before she changes her mind. Oh, okay. All right, or we're, we're just creepily standing in the doorway here. All right, uh, Juliana says, thank you for welcoming us, Mrs. Martins. Hmm. Silva here will film our conversation, okay? All right, I, I I guess that is us. We are we are Silva, uh, the camera the camera dude. Will he now? I'll have to think about that. Oh, what? Would you like to drink anything? Tea? Coffee? Oh, I never refuse a cup of coffee. I'll go make some. She pulled a fast one on you, huh? Forget that. Let's snoop around while we have the chance. Make sure to get anything that catches your eye on camera. We're surrounded by material here. Okay. All right. I guess we're, we're taking a look around. 
Look at these certificates. Journalism degree from UFRGS, specialization in communication. Walter was well educated. I think Mrs. Martin's is just the same. What a waste. What? Oh, it would be a shame if we only had shots of the same wall. So look around the whole room here, okay? Oh, okay. All right. Um, there are a lot of books in this house. Anything interesting? Hmm. There's a book that doesn't quite fit here. Let me see. It's an electronics manual. It's bookmarked on a page about the cathode ray tube, the CRT. The pages are loose. Okay, all right, that's kind of weird. Um, oh, oh, we got a, uh, a doggo here. All right. Um, good one. We need a nice shot of gunpowder. Oh. Dog's name is Gunpowder? Walter even carried the dog's picture in his wallet. He showed it around as if it were a photo of his son. Hmm. Okay. Alright. Um, okay, so... I think that's everything here. Let's uh, go over here. Uh, is it gonna rain today? Hardly. The rooster says otherwise. Look. Ah, uh, these roosters never get it right. Hmm. Guess we can use this take to set the mood. Hey, I can hear her putting water in the filter. She'll be back soon. Check out all you can now. All right, all right. Oh, let's fucking calm down here. All right. Uh, let's look at the TV. Hey. That TV shot looks good. Something funny about this TV. I think there was a lightning strike nearby the other day. Might have messed it up. Actually, I'm pretty sure it happened the same day that Walter... You know. Hey. Okay. I don't know. Walter did something. All right. Whoa, VCR player. Fancy. How much is one of these going for now? Some two million cru cru cruzeros? More than that, I think. Walter took a loan to pay for this. He told me this one time he... Uh, he told me this one time he gave me a ride. Okay, all right. Expensive VHS player weird TV and like a fucking chicken a weather fucking chicken all right what do we got what do we what do we got here I got a bookshelf look a daily trophy oh right Walter got one for an article he wrote back in the 70s the station's owner thought this would make us stand out more but it didn't happen Local stations have zero chances against the big ones. I think they even had a lobby going on to hush this up. Okay. All right, we we got we got some photos down here. Uh, what's this one? Look at this photo. Some scenery. Not very appealing scenery. Plus, it's out of focus. This photo has a story behind it. I can feel it. I might ask her about it during the interview. Coffee's almost done. Oh, all right. I guess we're done looking around. Okay. Might, uh, probably could have been a little better about that. I feel like we missed some things.
Okay, um, yeah, we'll be polite. Yes, thank you. I would love some coffee or whatever the fuck you are offering us. Be my guest. So, did you think it over? I did. <sighs> Let's get this done with. Great, we'll begin shortly. Let's shoot the interview on that chair, Silva. Ready? No, but does it matter? Okay, let's go in three, two, one. We're here with Mrs. Adriana Martins, wife of Walter Martins, our dear colleague who left us so abruptly. She agreed to give us an interview during these most trying of times. The house itself really tells a story about how you two lived. Oh. Oh, okay, so the, the shit that we looked at. Okay, a uh, blurred photo on the shelf. You have a rather peculiar picture in your living room. Ah, that was the first picture I took with the two of us. Oh, yeah, there it is, like... To the right of her. That is kind of like a weird photo. It just kind of looks like a blurry side of a house. That is kind of weird. I put the camera on a tripod and set it up to take our picture. Then, well, this lapwing showed up out of nowhere. I think we were too close to its nest. The bird got furious and attacked the camera right when it took the picture. Then it attacked us. That was the result. A portrait neither of us appear in from yours truly, the great photographer. He found it so funny we had it framed. I used to find it funny too. Oh, uh, let's see. The uh, ward in the living room. Walter was a very high caliber professional working at a small station. Would you like to comment on that? Oh, oh, no, this is Juliana. Walter was a very high caliber professional working at a small station. Would you like to comment on that? He felt he had less problems with higher ups when working at a smaller station. He could suggest topics, be more hands on. He also believed in keeping local stations alive. We lived well. He wasn't an ambitious man, not in that sense. He was a good man. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. <coughs> All right. Let's, uh, let's talk about the dog, Gunpowder. What's been getting you through these difficult times? Gunpowder here helped me more than anything else. The dog? Of course, he's been quite sad. He knows something's amiss. He misses Walter. At least taking care of him has taken my mind off things. Um, we saw an electronics manual. Care to explain that? Walter, what, um, uh, Walter was an avid reader. What had he been reading this, these last few days? He'd walk around the house with some manual or something in his hands. An electronics manual, I think. He kept messing around with the VCR. I noticed because he even stopped reading the papers. Look, I'm sorry. I don't think I can keep going. 
Of course, Mrs. Martins. We have enough material already. He was so different, so nervous. I never expected him to... I never expected him to... Dot, dot, dot. No one expected that, Mrs. Martins. I still can't even imagine Walter handling a... Wait, what? What? What the fuck are we talking about now? Gun? What gun? Walter never had a gun. The... The gun! The one he used during the show's broadcast. He did not use a gun. I know it was horrible, but I saw it when he pulled the trigger. That's what Ferreira told you back at the station, right? Oh shit. Okay, so we... we no, I was told he used a knife. No, I was told he took poison. No, I was told he hanged himself. What the fuck? Okay, so... All right. So what I'm picking up here is that Walter um, was Adriana's husband and was someone we worked with at the TV station. Um, I guess he tried to broadcast a VHS tape uh, containing something and then also killed himself like on like on air I guess um I don't know which one to pick oh we'll go with the first one no I I was told he used a knife what how can that be my god I knew it Ever since he got that damn tape. The tape he tried to broadcast? Kelso examined the tape back at the studio. I think the film was burned, something like that. That wasn't... That wasn't the... THE tape. Not the original one. That was a copy. Seriously? Do you still have the original one? Yes. Here. Oh no. Oh no. This is, this is this is so fucking not good. This is not good at all. Nope. Haunted VHS tape. Nope. 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 I don't know what he saw on this thing, and I don't know where he got it from. Walter made me swear to never watch it. He only watched it when I wasn't home or in the small hours of the morning. You want to watch it, don't you? For your show. I don't think that's a good idea, but I'm too tired to try to change your mind. I... I'm going outside to have a smoke. I don't even want to hear this thing. Well, damn, okay. All right. This is it. We have quite the story here. Uh, do we, do we, what, what, what are we even doing here? Like maybe, maybe we should just go. You look like, uh, you look like you've seen a ghost. You'll stay, right? All right, we have some options here. Uh, yeah, you know what? Uh, we're this is our first playthrough of this. We're we're fucking all in. We are all in. We're gonna we're gonna fucking. Stay. I want to see what's on this fucking tape. 
I want to see what's on this tape that made fucking Walter kill himself live on air at a TV station. Yeah, I just got to see what the hell's going on here. I knew I made the right decision in bringing you with me. Okay, this is how we'll do it. You film me as I watch the thing. We'll have more takes that way. We can insert the tape's content in the video during editing. Okay. Oh, I just got a... Uh... An achievement on Steam that I'm lacking common sense. <laughs> yeah, maybe may maybe we should not be watching this fucking videotape. All right, let's begin. Let's get my first impressions on film. We can fix it all on editing later. All right, here we go. There. I'll press play. It's starting. All right. Well, like her head is kind of in the way, so I guess we're not going to like see the uh, the full tape. Which I guess might be good for our character if this is like a fucking ring slash ringu haunted videotape situation we got going on here. All right. Okay. Um, what is this place? Okay. Uh, yeah, some kind of red room. I don't recognize this building. Okay. Uh, blue screen with some weird symbols on it. These symbols, I, I can, almost. Do they mean anything to you? Uh, let's see. Looking at them makes my head hurt. Gives me deja vu, or I feel like I can almost understand them. You know, the the, the very first one seems like the weird way they had, like, the letters written for, um, that new, like, Dune remake movie. Where it's like D, or like basically like the backward C is a D U N, and then C. Even though Dune ends with an E. Um. Oh God, I don't know. Yeah, looking at that makes my fucking head hurt. I I'm I'm too tired for this shit. I don't get paid. I am an unpaid intern here. Uh, I don't fucking give a shit about any of this. Uh, this makes my head hurt. Leave me alone, lady. Me. It's the eyes. Oh, it's changed. Good. Okay, some like green fucking hallway here. So, he did go inside the building. W wait, what? What fucking building? What is even going on here? So, so he did go inside the building. The like green hallway building? What? What? is this place uh let's see it looks like a prison looks like a shopping mall looks like a museum looks like a school i don't know it looks like a weird green hallway i uh, i guess a prison i i don't fucking know looks looks like a prison prison Inside the cells are those are those people? He's just walking by everything. What sort of building is this? It's way too long. 
oh yeah uh, a fucking infinite prison hallway yeah like what is this what 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 the fuck is this look there's someone up ahead that guy he looks he looks Did you get that? I'll turn up the volume. Oh, please don't. Please do not turn up the fucking volume. Oh, okay. I guess we're guessing what this fucking ASMR guy is saying. A charred... Wait, me. Chard, take my hand. We'll take a walk. It's a zero inside the lost ark. I'll buy you the sky. Sounds like it mentions someone named Oscar or Zaka or a zooming control. Zaka. Hell yeah, Zaka. We're assuming control. Zaka. Zaka, you heard that? Really? I can't understand a damn thing. Let me turn up the volume one more time. Oh, uh, and the TV says diamond, 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 forever. Okay. That's cool. That's cool. Uh, let's see. Hey, you okay? That's it. I'm turning this thing off. I had it. I'm out of here. All right. Uh, well, we're, we're okay. So there's like options to leave. We're, I, I, I think we're going to just continue sticking with like staying here, uh, and investigating. Uh, hey, you okay? Uh, dot, dot, dot. Oh, community TV. All right, uh, eight oh eight PM. We got Cinna eight ten ten PM. We got Programma, and midnight we got Zero Reporter. Let's go. Some good TV for us uh, tonight. Uh, ju wait. Okay. Um. So Juliana says, "Okay, we're in the right building." Didn't she say that? of the game and also also I don't have a mouse cursor she has an extra N on her name now there was only one N in Juliana before is uh is that a typo or is that is that is that something that's supposed to happen? Are we fucking looping right now? Like, uh, Juliana has a new letter in her name and we're looping right back to before the interview with the lady with the crazy fucking Ringu videotape. All right, all right, all right. That's, that's, that's fine, that's fine. Um, <clears throat> okay, is the camera on? Uh, let me remove the lens cover. Okay, hurry up. 
Let me get the button. Sixth floor, apartment 608. Okay, so Juliana pressed the button this time, not us. You look like you've seen a ghost. Uh, I, I, I just got some deja vu. What the fuck is going on here? Right. Okay, all right. So... Okay, so we're clearly in some fucking time loop. There's a fucking Ringu VHS tape with weird shit on it. Um, a dead guy who worked at our news station who tried to broadcast this VHS tape to everybody, but then wasn't able to and killed himself on air. Um, okay. Let's go to the 608 already. Um... Okay, so last time we went towards the window. Uh, let's let's do that again instead of going right to room or apartment six oh eight. Uh, dot dot dot. Uh, continue towards the window. What are you doing? How about you stop wasting our time? Can you do that? Hmm? Um, I thought we could shoot some footage here for the video. Ah, okay. Well, you shot it, right? Come on, let's go. Okay, all right. We're right outside of the apartment. Uh, there's the apartment. Finally. All right, I'll do the talking. Okay, okay, Juliana, you're a little more aggressive on this on this second loop here. Just pounding on that fucking door. All right, Adriana says, "Good evening. We're from Channel Eight. We came to talk to you about what happened. You don't mind if we record this, right?" I... You want to talk about Walter, right? The recent events? Everything's stuck in your throat, isn't it? Come in. It might be good to speak to someone. Uh... Hey, aren't you coming on a little too strong? Y yeah... I, I, I think she might be coming on a little too strong here. Uh, there's something off here. There, there's something very off here. Uh, are you asking about the tape? Okay, uh, I'm thinking these first two ones. Uh, Juliana with the extra N is definitely coming on strong here. Uh, and there's clearly something off here because we've fucking done this before. We, uh, we have already inter interviewed this lady. Um... <laughs> Um, shit. I didn't... All right. Hey, aren't you coming out a little too strong, Juliana? No, we need to investigate this. She's got her whole life to mourn. <laughs> Dude, fucking what? <laughs> Come on, get in. All right. We're about to begin. Will you have anything? Tea? Coffee? No thank. Okay, this is different. This is fucking different. Okay, so the, the, the first time around, we were offered coffee and tea and Juliana was like, oh fuck, I never turned down fucking coffee. Like, give me all that fucking coffee. Now, she doesn't want it. Okay. No thanks. Well, I'll go make something anyway. No, let's just... God damn it. We'll have to wait for her. I'll... I'll have a look around here. 
Yeah. Whatever. Okay, yeah, that's different. Like, the uh, the first loop, Juliana was very like, oh, yeah, let's snoop around, get shit on video. Okay, so we got we got the dog, Gunpowder, here, who's no longer... Like, he was sleeping on the floor the, uh, the initial time around. Now he seems kind of a little bit concerned. Let's see... Hey, gunpowder. He seems a little nervous, uneasy. Or is he afraid? Yeah, I am. And I don't know. All right, look at all these certificates. Walter wasn't a complete dumbass, unlike some people back at the studio. Right but I don't recognize any of these institutions. Oh God, did he fucking go to like, like Arkham University fucking, the fucking goddamn Lovecraft college? <laughs> oh, oh, we got something new on TV. Okay, all right. We got a, a nice bird uh, TV show. Uh Oh, hey, that's the game we're playing. Right, right down there. Teleforum. That's what we're playing. It's on TV too. Cool. Uh, something about this TV gives me the creeps. Okay. These achievements are like really cryptic. Like, I just unlocked one looking at this TV that just literally said there's something there, right? I don't know. I don't know. This is like my first time playing this game. All right, check out this VCR. They might be expensive now, but I'm sure everyone will have one before long. I bet on that. Hey, there's a weird thing hanging, hanging above the front door. Look, go there and take it off. Wait, what? What door? Oh, wait. What? You heard me. You can reach up there if you jump, right? So take it down. It's getting on my nerves. Okay, so what the hell? Okay, fine. I'll take it down or I won't do that. Um... I feel like real life me would be like, what the hell? What, 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 no, what the motherfucking hell? Like, also, we, we did this interview already. Why are we looping? What the hell? What the hell? What the hell? Um, <laughs> oh God. What? All right. So I decided to like when we did the initial interview and then got to the vhs tape i was all in so maybe i should just stay I'm, I'm assuming this game probably has multiple endings uh so i think we'll uh we're we're gonna continue just being fucking all in let's let's get fucking nuts here okay fine i'll take it down there you go you didn't lose any fingers did you what do I do with this now? I don't care as long as it's away from me. Okay, weird, weird. All right, we got a, like a plant here. Uh, what kind of plant is this? No idea, man. It's well taken care of. I think Mrs. Martins didn't let the tragedy affect her routine. Maybe it's what's keeping her in functional Wait, what? Maybe it's what's keeping her in functional right now. There. Let's get to the point. Walter took a tape to the studio, but it wasn't the original one, was it? The original is here with you. How do you know that? 
me examine the one he had with him. I want to see the original. Well, yes, I have it here. Do you know where he found this tape? Is this why you came here? Had I known, I wouldn't have opened the door. Here, take it. I don't want to see this thing. I'll go have a smoke outside. Tell me when you're done. Unlocked an achievement that says, but you won't, will you? Oh, God. Fucking shit. Okay, all right. Uh, do you want to shoot a video of the tape or, hey, she's a widow, what's gotten into you? Um... I mean, the second one, it, like, something is wrong with Juliana with the extra N in her name. Uh, but we're, we're we're still playing all in. We're still playing all in. We're all in. Uh, do you want to shoot a video of the tape? Uh, no, we're not shooting anything. We don't have a lot of time, and I made her uncomfortable. Let me check the tape. Maybe there's something we can add to the video in editing. Meanwhile... Go talk to her. Interview the widow. You always wanted to conduct an interview, right? We can make some... We can make some time that way. Okay. See if she's up to answering some questions about the origin of this tape. Okay. Alright. We'll do that. Ah, there she is. Deep breaths. What's the smell? It's not the cigarette. No, focus. If I do a good job... Alright, I might get new opportunities. I can help Mrs. Martins feel a little better, or I'll probably change nothing, but I still want to do it. All right. Well, we're, we're all in. We're, we're, we're a fucking uh, TV news career guy. I might get new opportunities. Let's play the reporter. Mrs. Mar uh, Mrs. Martins? What is it? Are you done? Not yet. Juliana's watching. Okay. All right. So I, we're, we're saying Juliana's name with one N. This second loop, she has two Ns. So I, I, I don't know if this is just like a, like a basic translation, like error, or if it's supposed to be like that, like, just like thro throwing you off I guess I don't know but we're we're speaking her name as if she has one N if it's a uh, if it's done on purpose th it that might low-key be kind of fucking genius because I'm just like constantly questioning it and I, I, I think it kind of helps with like the what the fuck is going on here shit. Uh, <laughs> all right, not yet. Juliana's watching the tape. Meanwhile, I wanted to ask you some questions. For your program? Shouldn't the girl be asking the questions? Uh, she's busy with the tape. It's an opportunity for me, actually. I got worried about you. Um... Yeah, uh, but she's she's busy with the tape. She she loves that fucking tape. Of course, always the tape. Fine, let's do this interview of yours. You'd better think very carefully about these questions of yours. My head's about to burst. Um, what's in the tape? I don't know. I never watched it. Walter made me promise I'd never watch it. I was kind of curious before. Not anymore. 
Uh, why did he make a copy? Why do we copy anything? To preserve, to share. That's what I think it's least. To share. Just thinking about that girl alone in my living room watching that thing makes my skin crawl. Say, why is she so interested in that tape? Um... I wouldn't know. To tell the truth, so am I. Important piece of this case. Actually, I, I don't really... Why is she obsessed with this tape? Okay, so... Maybe, maybe she's obsessed with the tape on this loop because in the, like, in the initial part, we videotaped her watching the tape. We didn't really get a good view of the TV because we were taping, like, her head was, like, in front of it. So we just got kind of, like, the corners. So maybe now that we're apparently looping, uh, like, whatever is going on with the tape has gotten inside her, and now she's obsessed. I don't know. Because it, it, it sounds like Walter was pretty obsessed uh, with watching the tape and then eventually getting to a point where he made a copy to broadcast uh, to everybody watching uh, the news station and then when that didn't work he he just offed himself and apparently he offed himself in a way that looked different to everybody some people saw a gun we said knife and then there were options of poison and hanging very fucking weird uh let's see uh it's an important piece of this case we'll go with that yes i could see the greed on your colleague's eyes when she asked about the tape to be honest i thought you'd ask questions about walter he was your co-worker no uh that was the plan was it really don't you think that colleague of yours is acting a little strange? I... I could swear I've seen her before. Yeah, we, 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 we just fucking interviewed you, like, minutes ago. <laughs> to be honest, I have a feeling I've seen you before as well. Maybe I've seen her at the studio. I'm not sure. I don't think so. I haven't been working there for long. Hmm, maybe that's why you don't seem to be like her. Not yet, anyway. Me? Yes. Why are you in this, anyway? Uh, this is my job. I don't get to pick my tasks. Can we conclude the interview first? Well, I mean... This first one seems to be obvious. Oh, uh, well, this is my job. I don't get to pick my tasks. So you choose, so you choose to omit yourself, right? No. I shouldn't blame you. You're not at fault. Not really. You know, I get it. I get the idea of moving up the ladder. The allure of a sensationalist piece of news. You can see it too, can't you? Nothing good came from this tape. From this whole thing. Uh, it really didn't cause anything positive until now, or that's precisely why we need to investigate. Hmm. Yeah. We gotta investigate. Do we really need to? Is it really the search for truth that's motivating the story you're working on? Or is it something else? Oh, uh, if it's something else, then it wouldn't be right. I, I want to know. It is. Uh, that's the reason it's necessary. Okay, so we're, 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 we're playing all in guy and we're playing all in guy. I want to fucking know what is up with this goddamn fucking tape. Uh, what is going on here? I, I want to know. At least you're being honest. Look. I've got a splitting headache. 
Go check if she's done, then leave, please. I want my living room back. Thanks for the interview, Mrs. Martins. Okay, all right. Uh, we're, I guess, kind of going back in. Um. All right, hey, community TV again. All right, what do we got on TV tonight? Uh, 808, Cine 8, 1010, Programma, Midnight, Zero, Reporter, all the same. Uh, oh, uh, T124, Teleforum. What time is T124? Also, should I make a note of that? All right, uh, the apartment. Which apartment? Um, I know it's, yeah, it's 608. Why do we have these like other options though? Yes, that was it. I had someone else with me. Ju Jul oh my fucking god okay all right uh it's not julia but they have both of the fucking spellings here okay so first interview was juliana with one n and the second one was the misspelling with the two n's so this this was clearly this was clearly purposeful I don't even know which one to pick. Okay, so Juliana with one end, uh, one N was um, before watching the tape and then she watched the tape. Then we looped and the mean Juliana who was obsessed with the tape was with two ends. Uh, maybe we'll go with a Juliana with one N because she was nicer. How could I forget her? Each step makes it harder to remember. That tape. What I saw in it. Uh, let's see. I watched an unrecorded nightmare. But it was recorded. That's a weird comment. Uh, was seeing and forgetting the name of what I saw, or I saw the past of a future that never happened. That's weird. Uh, we'll, we'll go with the unrecorded nightmare. I don't know. And if it was not recorded, oh. Yeah, if it was not recorded, how was it on the fucking tape? That's weird. Can I ever awake from it? The apartment. She stayed there. All right, we, we, we got some fucking noises going on here. All right, uh, better to record everything. Everything can be used. Ah, uh, yes, the uh, the classic uh, fun footage movie thing of, uh, we, go, we gotta keep recording. People need to see this. We gotta keep recording. All right, um. The sound, do I really want to follow it? Uh, 
Okay, what what is over here? I need to go on. Is this the right way? Okay, let's follow the sound, I guess. Let's go to the right. Uh, yeah, I need to go on. What is this door? Yeah, we, we haven't seen this door before, have we? Is this where she was? The door won't budge. But there's a grate. I don't want to see what's in there, or I need... Yeah, we need to fucking see what's in there. We're, we're gonna fucking see what's in there. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Okay, great. That woman, I... Do I know her? Why am I tearing up like this? It's no use. Uh, all right, uh, clearly there's nothing else we can do. All right. Weird smell here. Where did I smell this weird smell before? <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. All right, all right. Okay, um... Wait, keep going. Okay, uh, we got gunpowder here. Uh, gunpowder? What happened here? Why is the dog here? Where's your owner, hmm? Hey, gunpowder? Where's your owner? Am I imagining things, or is the dog avoiding the apartment? Oh no, not now, come on. Uh, gunpowder. Come back here. What's gotten into him? He just dashed down the hall. Huh? Looks like he was lying on top of some note. Uh, go after gunpowder or inspect the note. Um, I mean, Probably should go after gunpowder, but I, I, you know, gotta read the fucking note. Gotta read the note. All right, it's a note. Okay, and quote, I've had it and did what I shouldn't. Now, I have an unending nightmare in my brain. In an endless loop with no chance of escape. And what scares me the most? It's not much worse than the life I left behind. If anyone reads this, don't leave gunpowder al alone. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. You tell me now. You tell me now that gunpowder is gone to not leave him alone. It uh, kind of reminds me of uh, uh, when, when, when I uh, streamed... Uh, uh, song of horror and uh, like towards the beginning like when you're first exploring the haunted house in the haunted house chapter and you pick up a photo and it's just like a photo whatever and then you flip it around and it's like uh, like don't look at this photo uh, and it's like oh wait what what and then you flip it back and it's like booze like scary horror fucking ghost face um <laughs> All right, um, she, she also, ugh, these letters are, are giving me ver vertigo, vertigo. Who's that? Wait, the dog, where did he go to? Gunpowder? I'm, I'm going inside. All right, let's go inside. Uh, I'm going, I need to. No, I want to leave this place. Nope, we're, we're all in on this playthrough. We're going in. Am I going inside? Really? Fuck yeah, you are, Mr. Cameraman. Really? 
I will. Heh. <laughs> I just noticed it now. And it's awful. Say it out loud or keep it to yourself. What did what did you note? Oh yeah. All right. Why am I asking what did you notice when I can just have him say it out loud? Let's say it out loud. The camera carries me, not the other way around. I can't even tell when this started. Perhaps a long time ago. Maybe when I submitted my application. Gunpowder? I'm going in. Weird. Okay, new achievement unlocked. It's not that apartment anymore. Okay, yeah, someone smashed up the fuck out of that TV. Um, I don't know what... Oh, I mean, I mean we're probably looking for gunpowder, right? Oh, we, we, we did take that... Whatever that, like, horseshoe thing was. Uh, off the door on our second loop. Okay, alright. Wait. Okay, there's something in there. Alright, let's go check it out. Maybe? Oh, okay, there we go. Oh, is that- oh, okay. Gunpowder's hanging out. He's fine. Okay, there's Walter. Esteemed viewers, good night. Today we'll have a special broadcast in our show. Possibly my last one. I have an announcement to all of you. During the last few weeks I've made a discovery that has haunted me. Words are not enough to describe what I uncovered. So, I'll have to show it to you, and there is a chance this will come to haunt you as it has haunted me. However, my profession, my work during all these years has been to reveal the truth. If we wanted to be free, I need all of you to uh, know what I'm about to show you. In order to do this, I ask that you correctly tune your TV. Do not cross your legs. This is important. But stay at ease and watch carefully. And then it... Okay, so maybe he didn't kill himself on air. They, they, they probably cut it out. Uh, this VHS is Community TV's exclusive property. Oh, okay. Um... So I guess that that that's the end. Uh, but we have some lock stuff. So I'm I'm assuming these are like alternate endings. Uh, we clearly got this one. We have the uh, the two different community TV things. Uh, the one that had the uh, also like it changed like the time uh, for one of the programs to T124, which. There was a T in the elevator. There was a T button in the fucking elevator. Okay, uh, we're, we're, we're gonna go through this again. Um, what is this, though? What is this? Two people have been reported missing. A team has not been seen since fourth. We had a chance to speak with the mother. Do you personally believe that there's something sinister hiding in there? No, of course not. People love ghost stories, but in the end, they're... Just stories, just stories, just stories, just 
Okay, um... I'm assuming that's probably, like, a game these devs are working on, and this being free uh, is, like, a proof of concept kind of, kind of situation. Like, uh, yeah, like, I think I mentioned before, like, the original version of Doki Doki Literature Club, which was free uh, before they re-released it in that, like, plus version. Hell, I'm, I'm fucking down with that. Um, this first playthrough was pretty, pretty interesting, cryptic, weird. Uh, I'm intrigued. Uh, let's go through it again. I want to see what happens if we uh, punch T-124 into the elevator. Um, oh, rewind. Okay, let's rewind. Okay, so we got, we're in, wait a second. Uh, so Juliana with two N's is looking a bit more disheveled than before. Interesting, okay. Okay, this is the right building. Hey, you got that camera on? All right, let's remove the lens cover. There. Right, it's best to have as much material as possible. We want the sixth floor. Can you get the button? Uh, abso-fucking-lutely. T, one, two, four. Okay, all right. We're, we're, we have no control here. Oh, now we do. Okay. Um. What the fuck? Walter's dead. Uh, <clears throat> yes. Wait, we're, we're, we're not us anymore. We're the operator? Mr. Walter Martins, you are in possession of a VCR, correct? Yes. What do you want? I have a very special delivery for you, sir. This tape. Okay, so that's like, uh, all right. Uh, clearly, it was like a little puzzly bonus alternate kind of like ending. Um, you know, assuming someone noticed the T-124 on the, uh, uh, like the, uh, TV station ad thing. Um, that's cool. Who's the fucking operator, though? Who is the operator? It, maybe all will be revealed in Drowned Lake. All right, let's rewind again. Um, let's do, like, some opposite options um i don't know if i'm gonna do a bunch of playthroughs of this maybe we'll just do like an opposite and see where we are and then move on um all right okay this is the right building hey you got that camera on on now yeah it's best to have as much material as possible we can edit it all later All right, sixth floor. Yep, 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 yep. 
What is it? You look like you have something to say. Uh, was just thinking about what happened. What happened? It was bizarre. You didn't see it, did you? They just told me how it happened. What he used to... You know. You're lucky. I wish I hadn't seen it. You heard it, right? He gave Kelso a VHS tape. The VT operator? Right. Kelso was supposed to broadcast the tape, but he couldn't. Technical issues. Then, bam, it happened. Oh, we're here. Come on. Okay, we're going to apartment 608. Easy to remember. Alright, let's uh, go to the trash bags uh, this time around. Alright, there it is. I think it's that apartment just ahead. Here we are. Well, let's get ready, shall we? You can film her getting the door and all that. So, should I knock on the door, ring the bell? It'll look better on the video. Uh, we knocked last time. Um, let's uh, ring the bell. Uh, let's see. I hope the camera doesn't act up during the interview. What do you mean? It malfunctions. Sometimes it blacks out for no reason. I think they gave me this one because I'm new. Let's do this story. Then Ferreira won't be able to deny you some new equipment. Okay. Let me try again. Uh, let's see. Uh, say, did you work with Walter for long? Some, uh, four years. I'm... This hit me hard too, you know? I want to do something for him. And take advantage of the situation in the process? Sure. He'd say I'm demonstrating a sharp sense for opportunity. All right, third time's the charm. What do you want? Hi, Mrs. Martins? We're from Channel 8. We came to give you our condolences. Okay, so even that is different. So we're doing like a like a new playthrough, but even that is different. I'm I'm pretty sure. I don't think we said that before. Uh do you really need a video camera for that? We're making a special program about Walter. A homage, a kind of re Oh fuck. Wait. Okay, no. Yeah, we had Oh, that's weird. Okay, so I I'm remembering now. The very first, the very first time we were here interviewing this lady, I had an option of what to say during that, and I mentioned making an homage. And now Juliana, with two ends, is saying it instead of like giving us the option. Interesting. All right. A homage, a kind of retrospective, you see. He worked at the station for so long. So we wanted to talk to you about him, about what happened. Right. Fine, come in. It might be good to talk about it. Uh, let's see. Quick thinker, huh? Homage. I uh, can't believe... Oh, no. Okay, I'm wrong. I'm wrong. This is where the option came in. But I don't think she said homage before. I'm gonna have to fucking like look back at the uh, the VOD. <laughs> uh, I can't believe she bought that shit. Maybe she needs this now. Come on, before she changes her mind.
Uh, thank you again for welcoming us, Mrs. Martins. Hey, Dog Nozzle! Welcome on in. How you doing? It's been like 800 years since I streamed last. Uh... <laughs> Oh God! Hope you're hope you're doing well though. Hope you're doing well. Yeah, we're we're fucking back. Um, uh, good to see you, buddy. Yeah, I know. I. <sighs> it's uh, it's been just like suck city basically. Like like not not you know like, just work, you know. I've literally been like working like every single fucking day and like just being exhausted from that um has kind of like kept me from streaming and then the weird hours but mostly just being exhausted uh so a, a little bit of an accidental streaming break has happened but we're back we are fucking back uh and I want to make sure um I know I mentioned this on, I think, uh, uh, Jala's Discord that I want to just start streaming at whatever hours I can, basically. So not all these nighttime, uh, streams, like if I have like the day off, maybe, uh, like, like an afternoon stream again, like I did a few of those back in the day. Uh, that might be for the best. Uh, let's see. Uh, thank you again for welcoming us, Mrs. Martins. Hmm. Silver here will film our conversation, okay? Will he now? I'll have to think about that. Wait. Also, did, like, her portrait down there change... And also, will he now? I'll have to think about that. What does that mean? And does that have something to do with that, like, weird fucking dream loop we were in? And, like, about us realizing that, like, we're not holding the camera. The camera is controlling us. What? Yeah, what? What? What the fuck is going on here? Would you like to drink anything? Tea? Coffee? Oh, I never refuse a cup of coffee. Okay, so that is classic Juliana, but that was classic Juliana with the one N, not the two Ns. Mean Juliana is the one with the two Ns, but now she wants coffee. This game is fucking weird. I'll go make some. Okay, so we accepted coffee last time. Uh, I don't think I'm going to this time. She pulled a fast one on you, huh? Forget that. Let's snoop around while we have the chance. Make sure to get anything that catches your eye on camera. We're surrounded by material here. Okay, so let's see if we can find some other, other shit. Uh, so, yeah, we, we already looked at the, the TV. Oh, we didn't... Whoa! What the fuck was that? What was that? Hey, I'm, I'm just going to look at this photo here. We didn't look at it last time. There's a painting here. I think Mrs. Martins painted this. Oh, it would be a shame if we only had shots of the same wall. So look around the whole room here, okay? All right, I know. Um, nope, don't care about. Oh, what is this? Look at this headline. The tragic passing of Walter Martins. So it's made the news already. I'm surprised she actually kept the paper. Me too. I guess people have different ways of mourning. 
Okay. Um. All right. Yeah. What's the deal with this fucking horseshoe thing? Yeah, I hear that. Yeah. <laughs> uh. Fucking work. Life. Blah. Is that a horseshoe? Seems so. Like, for good luck? I didn't know Walter was superstitious. Okay, so in in the uh, the second loop, we took it down when, when Giuliano with the two ends was all angry about it and didn't want it up there. And then things got bad, bad. Uh, so if we end up in that loop again, we'll we'll keep that up there. I think. I remember Walt. One second. I just noticed that Juliana's portrait is staticky. And now she suddenly has just one N in the name. It was two N's just a little bit ago. And we know this is not a translation issue because we literally had to say her name and we had options. And two of the options were Juliana with one N and Juliana with two N's. Um, I think this game is like, it's not like scary. Like, I don't find it like scary at all, but it's like unsettling and in, in it's like just subtle weirdness and just these weird little things that are just making my brain go kind of crazy. Um, <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, I remember Walter bought this raincoat to cover a story. Some lake where it rains a lot or something. Oh, fucking Drowned Lake? Drowned Lake? Right. The image got stuck in my head because he vanished inside the thing. I remember he got cheated out of some 500 cruzeros for an oversized coat. He looked ridiculous in it, but he paid so much. See, now she's got the two ends. Uh, but he paid so much for the damn coat, he just had to wear it. Poor guy. Hey, I can hear her putting water in the filter. She'll be back soon. Check out all you can now. All right, all right. Let's. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Uh, this plant is begging for water. Guess it's been neglected in the last few days, considering all that's happened. Can we just, like, leave? Oh, okay, we're, we're just kind of looking through the little peephole thing. We're not leaving. Okay. Um, is there anything specifically out here we can... No, I guess not. Wait, I just got an achievement. There's something out there. What? What is out there? Uh, that can't be a typo, can it? Um, I, I, I don't think so. So, um, so like, basically, like, like you, you, you just kind of like popped in to my second playthrough of this we we got or actually technically third so we got we got like our first ending and then there was like a weird a weird thing that i noticed and then i was able to kind of punch that into an elevator at the beginning of the game and i we got like a weird alternate ending and there's like other endings that like it shows you that are locked um so like this playthrough we're kind of going through like opposite of our first time um, and, uh, anyways, um, like when things were getting like really weird, um, and we were by ourselves in kind of like dream apartment hell, and we were trying to remember who we were with before, 
and the options were Juliana with one end, Julia, and Juliana with two ends. Um, like I thought maybe it was like a translation thing before before that, but then when that happened, like like clearly it's on purpose. Yeah, it's a uh, very very weird, very interesting. Like just. Instead of going like for straight up scares, it's like this weird, like it's like this game is giving me these like what the fuck up, vi oh, like what the fuck is going on vibes, and like is is this real? Like maybe like almost like paranoia. Like <laughs> it's so weird. Like the 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 shit in this game is just. The creepy stuff in this game is just really subtle, I think. Um, it's weird. All right. Um, yeah, I guess so. I, I don't know. I guess there's nothing out there. All right. Um, oh, all right. We got gunpowder down there. We looked at him. Oh, what is this? Um, oh, yeah. We, we went through the books before. Yeah, the electronics manual. CRT TVs. VHS tapes. Okay. Um. We looked at the chicken before. We, we never asked her about the chicken, though. The rain chicken. Oh. Oh. I don't think we asked her about the TV either. Yeah, there's something funny about the TV. Okay. Coffee's almost done. Will you have one? All right. Last time we had one and things went bad. So, no, I'm fine. Feel free to have one if you change your mind. So, all right, that was an achievement called Caffeine Yellows Your Teeth. Uh, so, did you think it's over? I did. Let's get this done with. Great, we'll begin shortly. Let's shoot the interview on that chair, Silva. Ready? No, but it doesn't matter. Okay, let's go in three, two, one. Actually, before we start the interview, I am going to take a quick restroom break and uh, refill my water here. And uh, we'll be back in about a minute or so, and uh, we'll continue on with our I guess uh, technically third playthrough of uh, Teleforum, uh, which is a, a an absolutely fascinating fucking horror game that is ten days old. It's a brand new fucking game, and it's free on Steam. It is clearly uh, a proof of concept free game for uh, Drowned Lake, um, but this is so fucking cool. Uh, highly recommend it. This is not sponsored or anything, um, but y'all should play it. Uh, anyways, be right back. <laughs> All right. Welcome back. Time for some more uh, Teleforum. Uh, let's see. Okay, let's go in three, two, one. We're here with Mrs. Adriana Martins, a wife of Walter Martins, our dear colleague who left a sword. See, this is all different. The, this is new playthroughs, and these lines are fucking different. Like, I swear. We did not, like, start the interview like this. I don't believe. <laughs> She agreed to give us an interview during these most trying of times. The house itself really tells a story about how you two lived. 
Okay, all right. Um, yeah, okay, the amulet above the front door. Did Walter have any superstitions? He didn't seem to have one, but I was just a co-worker. We never get to completely know someone, right? No, never. He wasn't religious either. So that amulet above the front door is yours? No. Uh, is this game Brazilian? Uh, it... Maybe? I don't know. I don't know. Um, let me let me click here. Oh, that doesn't tell me anything. Um, oh, yep, they are. They are, uh, 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 Mon Monumental Collab is uh, the devs, and this says Mon Monumental is a collective spread throughout Brazil, a team of award winning professionals. Uh, well known for their work with narrative and atmospheric games. So yeah, they 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 are Brazilian. Okay. Good to know. Okay. Back to the game. Uh no. Care to elaborate? No. Okay. All right. So the horseshoe above the door was not Walter's or Adriana's, and she will not tell us where it fucking came from. That's weird. That's that's weird. Okay. Um. Uh, the sickly plant. What about the last 24 hours? Just look around the house. I have been forgetting things. I would have forgotten to feed gunpowder if he didn't remind me so often. Okay, I was wondering because I mentioned uh, the, oh yeah, the, uh, okay, yeah, the, the currency, yeah. And, yes? What a cruel question, girl. Let's, uh, go on. Oh, wait, nope, this is Juliana. Let's, uh, go on, yes? Uh, let's see. Um, Walter's raincoat. We, we, we didn't ask about that before. Many of Walter's things are still around here. Yes, I've been thinking about selling the apartment because of, of everything. These things just make it all more difficult. I'm thinking of getting rid of everything. It's hell. Oh, uh, let's see. Um, yeah, we, we didn't ask about the TV. I'm curious about the TV being strange. Uh, the television seems strange. Walter dedicated a good portion of his professional life to TV. I couldn't help but notice your television here. I... Yes, we had a blackout that day. There was a horrible lightning strike nearby. Right after the broadcast. Almost gave me a heart attack. Okay, so... That's like a weird thing too. So Walter goes on air. He attempts to play this tape. This haunted whatever the fuck tape. But it's a copy and it doesn't work. 
I guess uh, they they pull him off air but he kills himself and when he kills himself there's a lightning strike that affects like their TV it's weird like 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 was the lightning strike trying to go after like the original copy of the uh, the the VHS tape I don't know it's just weird uh, the TV hasn't been working properly since then. I leave it on so the house feels less empty. Look, I'm sorry. I don't think I can keep going. Of course, Mrs. Martins. We have enough material already. He was so different, so nervous. I never expected him to. No one expected that, Mrs. Martins. I still can't even imagine Walter handling a gun. Okay, yeah, and this this part is so weird. Okay, so... I guess he wasn't pulled off air yet if everybody saw him kill himself in a different way. Which is so fucking weird. Gun? What gun? Walter never had a gun. The... The gun. The one he used during the show's broadcast. He did not use a gun. I know, it was horrible, but I saw it when he pulled the trigger. That's what Ferreira told you back at the station, right? Okay, so last time we picked, I was told he used a knife. Uh, the other options were poison or he hanged himself. Which, I think this last option is kind of, like, weird. Like, are, are like, people at, like, the studio watching him go through the process? Like, the, the much slower, like, suicide process of hanging oneself. Like, and tying up a rope, getting a chair, all that, and not, not fucking stopping it. Like, dude... <laughs> Let's, uh, let's go with that ri uh, ridiculous option. Uh, no, I was told he hanged himself. What? How can that be? My God. I knew it. Ever since he got that damn tape. The tape he tried to broadcast? Kelso examined the tape back at the studio. I think the film was burned, something like that. That wasn't the tape. Not the original one. That was a copy. Seriously? Do you still have the original one? Yes. Here. I don't know what he saw in this thing, and I don't know where he got it from. Walter made me swear to never watch it. He only watched it when I wasn't home or in the small hours of the morning. You want to watch it, don't you, for your show? Um, are we playing as Adriana? Uh, no. Um, we are the cameraman. Uh, so, uh, our co-worker is Juliana, and Adriana is the person we are interviewing, uh, who is married to Walter, uh, who is, uh, the, the main news guy, uh, who is, uh, dead now. Um, after getting obsessed with this VHS tape and then trying to broadcast it unsuccessfully and then killing himself on air. Uh, let's see. I don't think that's a good idea, but I'm too tired to try to change your mind. I... I'm going outside to have a smoke. I don't even want to hear this thing. Yeah, uh, this is like a weird game in general. Like, I, I don't even like get like what it's like about like, so like watching the tape is clearly causing like time loops. Like we are being thrown into different like timelines. Um, and then there was the whole aspect about us Like, uh, like, is it, is it maybe like a meta aspect? Like, I know, like, the, 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 the first loop, 
we uh, spoke about the camera controlling us. We were not in control of the camera. The camera was in control of us. So it, it like it, it's almost kind of like a meta thing of like, oh, I'm being controlled by some fucko playing a video game or something. I don't know. It's so weird. This game is cool. <laughs> All right, uh, you look like you've seen a ghost. You'll stay, right? Okay, uh, so, uh, first time around, we were all in. We were all in. We were, we were down with the videotape. We were down with fucking around and finding out. Now we're not. Are you crazy? I am fucking out. Whoa, whoa, stop right there. I'm not letting you throw this opportunity away. Look, you don't have to watch it. Just, just film me as I'm watching it. We'll have more takes that way. We can insert the tape's content in the video during editing. Oh, okay. I, I guess we gotta watch it regardless. All right. Right. Let's make some room here. I wish we could, like, see the whole fucking tape. Like, it's always, like, her head in the way, so we just see the edges of it. But I guess that makes sense because we don't go as crazy as Juliana does. Uh, since we only see part of it. All right, let's begin. Let's get my first impressions on film. We can fix it all on editing later. There, I'll press play. It's starting. Yeah, right? Oh, okay. Just film me as I'm watching it. That's so much better. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. Just watch me watching watch the tape through the video camera. You you're 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 fucking fine. Uh <laughs> What is this place? I don't recognize this building. Okay, I'm I'm going to try to like think about this. Because she's talking about not recognizing the building, and then later on she does, but then she doesn't, like, right after that. It's so fucking weird. Okay, yeah, uh, all right, we got the symbols. Uh, these symbols, I, I can almost... Do they mean anything to you? Okay, um... Last time we did looking at them makes my head hurt. Uh, other options gives me deja vu. I feel like I can almost understand them. Uh, that first one still fucking looks like the fucking Dune remake. The fucking letters D-U-N-C, even though it's supposed to be an E. Um, I think we'll go with this because we're, we're, we're fucking looping here. Uh, gives me a deja vu. Really? Me too. But where would I have seen this before? Oh, yeah, this weird fucking hallway. Oh, it changed. Good. So he did go inside. The that fucking line is fucking with me so bad. So he did go inside the building. What fucking building? What fucking building? What are we talking about? What building is this? What do you know, Juliana? Oh, Juliana's aware of the looping too then. Yeah, I, I think I think for like all of us, it's like a weird like, I guess just like the deja vu thing, like where we know something is up, but we're, we, we can't quite grasp it. Um. Man, I, I, I cannot wait for their, like, full new game, Drowned Lake. Like, if it has anything to do with this shit. Um, what, I, what, what building is this? What the fuck? <laughs> what? Yeah, okay, so, oh, so he did go into the building, and then instantly, what is this place? so weird 
Okay, so last time we, we picked looks like a prison. So now we have, uh, let's see, shopping mall, museum, or school. Uh, may yeah, may maybe it's like a green school hallway. Um, it's been a while since I've been in fucking school. Um, maybe, maybe they have green lighting now. I don't know. And infinite, infinite hallways. Um, I mean, my, my, my high school was literally kind of like an infinite hallway. Um, my high school was both the junior high and the high school attached and they were like long hallways. Um, so if, if, if they had like the green fucking lights, maybe, maybe this would be accurate. I don't know. Um, oh, dude, hey, slum. Thanks for the lurk. I, I, I really appreciate it. Uh, yeah, thanks for hanging out. Um, been lurking, but I gotta go to bed. Good stream. Good night. Oh, have a, have a, uh, a good night. Yeah, thanks for hanging. I had no idea you were here. <laughs> thanks for the lurk, though. Uh, very awesome. If, uh, there's literally anybody else in chat, y'all should be following Slum Drop Button. She is also a streamer and super awesome. Um, follow follow i don't know if there's anyone else here aside from slum and dog nozzle but <laughs> um i had uh i had you up as i was doing chores around the house awesome awesome well thanks for hanging out have have, have a have a good night um get uh get some good rest all right, we're, we're gonna pick, looks like a school. This prison, this hallway prison looks like a school. Are those classrooms? Why do their clothes look so much like my high school uniform? He's just walking by everything. What sort of building is this? It's way too long. Look, there's someone up ahead. That guy, he looks, he looks. Oh yeah, we got the creepy ASMR going again. Did you get that? I'll turn up the volume. Okay, uh, so last time we, we, we picked Zaka. We're assuming control Zaka. Um, so let's pick something else this time. Um, I don't know. Let's do this first one, which is just fucking weird. Chard, take my hand. We'll take a walk. Get to zero inside the Lost Ark. I'll buy you the sky. Chard? Who's Chard? You really heard that? I can't understand a damn thing. Let me turn up the volume one more time. And then, yeah, it's a, a, a whole bunch of fucking diamonds. All right, um, okay, so last time we did, um, hey, you okay? So now we got, that's it, I'm turning this thing off, or I... Yeah, uh, okay, we were trying to escape before. All right, <clears throat> I had it. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. I'm done with this fucking bullshit. Uh, Juliana says, dot, dot, dot. Community TV. We love community TV. 
right? Still the same programs. Love, uh, love watching Zero Reporter at midnight. Uh, all right, that has not changed to T124 yet. Okay, yeah, Juliana's fucking photo changes about as much as, like, the spelling of her name. Like, it's uh, literally different, like, every fucking time. That's crazy. All right, okay, we're in the right building. Is the camera on? Yep. Okay, hurry up. Let me get that button. Sixth floor, apartment 608. Whoa. Okay, we saw the person, whoever that was, is that Juliana? I know we saw that in like the, uh, the fucking purgatory hell loop, whatever the fuck that was. You look like you've seen a ghost. Uh, uh, yeah, just some deja vu. Just a little deja vu. Right. Let's get to the 608 already. Um, let's go to the window. Is there anything else we can do there? Um, yeah, let's keep going. What are you doing? How about you stop wasting our time? Can you do that? Hmm? What's wrong with you? What? Ah. I? I think Walter's death <clears throat> got to me. I'm sorry. Uh, it's okay. We're all shocked. Yeah. Let's head to the 608 then. All right. There's the apartment. Finally. All right. Um, well, I guess it doesn't matter. We, we've done a combo of ringing the bell and knocking. I'll do the talking. Good evening. We're from Channel 8. We came to talk to you about what happened. You don't mind if we record this, right? I... You want to talk about Walter, right? The recent events... Everything stuck in your throat, isn't it? Come in. It might be good to speak to someone. Uh, let's see. Hey, aren't you coming on a little too strong? There's something off here. Are you asking about the tape? Um. I don't even remember what we would have asked last time. I mean, there's clearly something fucking off here. There's clearly something off. <clears throat> Uh, hey, aren't you coming on a little too strong? No, we need to investigate this. She's got her whole life to mourn. Oh, okay. I, I, I think we actually picked that last time. I remember the line. She's got her whole life to mourn. Fuck, fuck her in this moment. Like a days after her husband's suicide on like national TV. Uh, she's got her whole life to deal with it. <laughs> so fucking mean. That is, like, the meanest fucking shit ever. Um, Juliana's kind of pushy, huh? Uh, yeah. So, like... Like, original, original, original Juliana was very nice. Uh, but these loop Julianas are not. Like, 
the second that nice Juliana watched the tape, things have been bad, including these actual like full replays that we're doing and uh, where things are just different anyways, um, which is kind of wild. It's pretty cool. But yeah, original, original Juliana was very nice. Uh, just uh, uh, she probably should not have watched uh, the VHS tape. Um, come on, get in. We're about to begin. Will you have anything? Tea? Coffee? No, thanks. Even though the original Juliana would never turn down a cup of coffee. Well, I'll go make something anyway. No, let's just... God damn it. We'll have to wait for her. I'll... I'll have a look around here. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> Julie... Wow, okay, yeah. This is so... I, I just love how different these playthroughs are. So weird. Okay, here's gunpowder. Hey, Gunpowder! He seems a little nervous, uneasy, or is he afraid? Yeah, so... I don't think he's afraid of us. It's It kind of looks like he's looking behind us. So, like, is, like, Julia... If Juliana's kind of, like, behind us and, like, to the side... Like, is he looking at Juliana, who's clearly, like... I don't even know. Haunted, cursed, whatever, whatever she got from the tape. Hmm. <laughs> All right. Um. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. All right. Um. Uh, we're we're just gonna like click through this shit really quick. Expensive VCR. Um, I don't think we asked about the the uh, award before. We'll we'll do that. Um. Okay. Uh, there's a weird thing hanging above the front door. Look, go there and take it off. Okay. So, all right. The horseshoe charm. We took it off before. Uh, I'm not going to now. Maybe things won't get as fucked up. If we don't, I'm keeping that up there. Uh, we'll look at that photo. Um, and there's the newspaper. Oh. Oh. Okay, the newspaper change. So now it's saying that Walter hanged himself on the broadcast. Which was what we picked last time. Interesting. And I I, 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 I don't think... Um, I might have to go back on the VOD. Uh, but the very, very, very first time, I don't think it said anything about his method of suicide. Uh, regardless of what we picked. There. Okay, all right. Let's get to the point. Walter took a tape to the studio, but it wasn't the original one, was it? The original is here with you. How do you know that? We examined the one he had with him. I want to see the original. Well, yes, I have it here. Do you know where he found this tape? Is this why you came here? Okay, so when we did the uh, the T124 ending, 
uh, we were no longer the cameraman. We were someone called the operator. Uh, and our little portrait thing was all glitching out. And basically, the operator gives Walter the tape. Why? Don't know. Is this why you came here? Had I known, I wouldn't have opened the door. Here, take it. I don't want to see this thing. I'll go have a smoke outside. Tell me when you're done. Oh, uh, let's see. Okay, um... Oh. Alright, do you want to shoot a video of the tape? Hey, she's... Okay, yeah, let's go with this one. Hey, she's a widow. What's gotten into you, Juliana? I don't have time for this. But... Fine, you're right. This whole thing is making me antsy. You know what? Why don't you go check up on her? Even better, interview her. You always wanted to do that, right? Here's your chance. See if she's up to answering some questions about the origin of this tape. Ah, there she is. Deep breaths. Deep breaths, everyone. What's the smell? It's not the cigarette. No, focus. If Oh, dude, the fucking hell loop had like a weird smell too. Is that connected? It's kind of like all, all of these timelines are like happening at like the same time and they're kind of like bleeding into each other. No, focus. If I do a good job. All right. Uh, we, we went with opportunities last time. Uh, yeah, well, I can help Mrs. Martins feel a little better. It's what I want to believe, at least. Mrs. Martins? What is it? Are you done? Not yet. Juliana's watching the tape. Meanwhile, I wanted to ask you some questions. For your program? Shouldn't the girl be asking the questions? Uh, let's see, busy with the tape. Uh, oh, yeah, let's, uh, actually, I got worried about you, ma'am. I've seen many people like that girl in this line of work. Because of Walter. People who stop at nothing, eh? Fine, let's do this interview of yours. You'd better think carefully about these questions of yours. My head's about to burst. Okay, uh, what's in the... She's never watched the tape, so I don't think she knows what's on the tape. Uh, yeah, what, how, how are you doing? Terrible. I haven't slept since... You know. Maybe I should have seen it coming. The atmosphere at home changed ever since that tape showed up. He would watch it many times a day, locked up in the room. He'd say he'd almost get it but never showed me anything he never showed it to me uh why did you keep the tape i have no idea why i kept the thing i should have burned it crushed it with a hammer but i couldn't i couldn't i think i see him when i look at the tape you know just thinking about that girl alone in my living room watching that thing makes my skin crawl. Say, why is she so interested in the tape? Um, I don't know. I wouldn't know. No? Isn't that why you came here? I mean, isn't that what the story is about? I don't, don't remember. 
Don't you think that colleague of yours is acting a little strange? Yeah, yeah she, she's acting very fucking strange. She's been acting strange in all of or most of these fucking interviews that we've done. I I could swear I've seen her before. To be honest, I have a feeling I've seen you before as well. Yep, yep, we know. Maybe I've seen her at the studio. I'm not sure. I don't think so. I haven't been working there long. Hmm. Maybe that's why you don't seem to be like her. Not yet, anyway. Me? Yes. Why are you in this, anyway? Okay, alright. Last time we picked... Well, this is my job. I don't get to pick my tasks. Uh, so we'll go uh, with... Uh, can we conclude the interview first? No. No, we can't. Well, well, fuck. All right, okay, Adriana. I thought I was conducting the interview here, but clearly you are. Clearly you are. And I mean, she kind of is. She, 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 you know, she actually kind of is. She has turned this around on us. She's like asking us shit. Um... <laughs> Uh, she seems to know a lot about the effects of the tape. Yeah, I'm 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 very curious about that, and like I I don't think we're gonna get any like clear answers here. Um, but it's kind of like like I mentioned before, it, it it just seems like these multiple like timelines are kind of like bleeding into each other. Like like it's kind of like okay, so like. Anyone who's seen that movie, Donnie Darko, you know, a classic, classic, what, like, fucking high school or college mindfuck movie that got people into mindfuck movies. Um, but, like, at the end of the movie, um, spoilers, spoilers, uh, when, when Donnie actually dies in, in this particular timeline, um... And like, uh, like, like they're having that kind of like sequence with, with the, I, I think it's that fucking mad world piano cover, um, with, uh, you know, people outside, whatever crews dealing with the jet engine in the house thing. Um, but like, uh, there's that moment where, um, the mother is smoking a cigarette clearly upset and then um donnie darko's girlfriend in the previous timeline uh kind of stops and is like like they they share this moment where they're like weirdly waving to each other and they they have this look of knowing like they knew what happened before like 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 i am this this game is reminding me of that weird like, like they know, but they don't completely know. Like it's like a, a like a subconscious knowing. Uh, let's see. You came here. I didn't call anybody. I have the right to ask my questions. Hey, I'm conducting the interview here, Adriana. You know, I get it. I get the idea of moving up the ladder. The allure of a sensationalist piece of news. You can see it too, can't you? Nothing good came from this tape, from this whole thing. Oh, uh, let's see. That's precisely why we need to investigate. It really didn't cause anything positive until now. Okay, we haven't gotten these options before. We'll go with that. I know that better than anyone. And if that's the case, wouldn't it be better to stop? Okay, our job is to inform people so others don't need to pay the same high cost. I don't have the authority to cancel the story, and maybe... Oh, yeah, maybe. Maybe it would be better if we stopped. Yeah, we're, we're, we're trying to stop. Well? I don't want this story to be broadcast. I'm telling you quite plainly. Drop the camera. You serious? You can tell them the crazy old lady clawed at you. I don't care. Here. 
a little push out the window. Oh, we can we can do it. All right. Let's fucking yeet that motherfucking camera right out that window. Oh, okay. Are, are, are we going to get the T-124? Yep, there it is. I need to reach the apartment. All right, we're 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 back in fucking purgatory apartment hell. The apartment. Which apartment? Okay, so we 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 all know it's 608. We picked that the first time. Let's Let's do the opposite. 806. Was was that the number? I had someone else with me. Ju Jewel. Yeah, here here's the thing again. The two different spellings of Juliana. Uh, I love the old cable TV upcoming program screen. Yeah, same, same. Like, I don't know. Like, I, I, I know it's like a, like a whole fucking thing, and it's probably become like a horror subgenre that's become kind of overfilled. But like these like VHS style games, I don't know. I love them. I grew up watching fucking VHS shit, so. Um, let's, let's do a completely wrong name. Julia. Julia. Who is Julia? That tape. What I saw in it. Okay, last time we picked, uh, Unrecorded Nightmare. Which is... Just such a fucking weird thing. Having a record of an unrecorded nightmare. No wonder Ju No wonder Julia went crazy. Um I saw the past of a future that never happened. In which future do I exist now? From which past did I come? The apartment. She stayed there. Better to record everything. Everything can be used. That's right. We gotta keep filming. People need to people need to know. I need to go on. Is this the right way? Uh, yeah. We we went to the right before. So yeah, let's go to the left. weird smell here where did I smell this before oh weird I never noticed that before so there there's a sound if I'm thinking of looking to the right but not that way interesting okay uh let's go this way. All right, cameraman. Yeah, uh, uh, yeah. Let's go back. Actually, um, is this the apartment? The smell is coming from inside the apartment. Oh, I know what it is. The smell. It's o ozone. Look into the smell's origin. Uh, 
Better to record everything. Everything can be used. Oh, dude, Dog Nuzzle, you're not wrong. This, this game is fucking weird. <laughs> I am I am absolutely like I love this fucking game. This game is so fucking good. I cannot believe this is this is free. This is free on Steam. And it's it's, it's weird and fucked up and bizarre and I love it. All right, let's let's go this way. The smell, it's stronger here. Okay, the smell, no, or follow the smell. All right, let's follow, let's follow the smell. We, we did not do this before. Is this the apartment? The smell is coming from inside the apartment. Okay, yeah, ozone. It's making me nauseous. Okay, um, is there a way we can, like, just leave? Let's go back. Is that the same door I came across earlier? Isn't it? No, I've got a weird feeling here. Let's go back again. All right. Uh, okay. I guess we can. All right. So we gotta we gotta deal with the dog situation. Gunpowder. What happened here? There's something off about the city outside, as if the buildings were too close. Why is the dog here? Where's your owner, hmm? Hey, Gunpowder, where's your owner? Am I imagining things? Or is the dog avoiding the apartment? Okay, now Gunpowder's gonna run away. And last time we picked to read the note that Gunpowder was laying on that was like, oh, um, yeah. So here's some creepy lines and also don't leave Gunpowder alone. And it was like, oh, you, you, you fucking game. You fucking game. So we're, we're, we're gonna go after gunpowder, I guess. Oh no, not now. Come on. Ugh. Gunpowder. Come back here. What's gotten into him? He just dashed down the hall. Huh? Looks like he was lying on top of some note. Although now I'm I'm actually curious if the note is actually different since these are all different timelines. It probably is, but we'll 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 go after Gunpowder. All right, let's go running after the doggo. Gunpowder, I'm I'm going inside. Wait, no. Okay, shit. God damn it. Um. We were trying to drop this whole thing, so we should probably go with the second option. No, I want to leave this place. Enough. The story? It was all wrong since the start. All right, do we take the elevator or the stairs? <laughs> elevator would be faster, sure. Uh, elevator in Hell World could also just fucking crash you. Uh, just fucking. And stairs in Hell World could be like that one SCP about like the infinite staircase. Um. All right. Well, let's uh let's try taking the elevator. Why not? Why not? Elevator would be faster. Let's get the fuck out of here. Just go already.
gunpowder? I'm... I'm going in... Oh my god, we're, we're, we're just... We're looping inside the loops. We are looping inside the fucking loops now. Uh... Yeah, thank, thanks for a totally no context decision game. Yeah. <laughs> this fucking game! Oh my god, I... I... <laughs> we're... I can't believe... We're, we're fucking looping inside the loop. All right, uh, let, let's try the other option. No, I want to leave this place. Uh, the story, it was wrong. Uh, stairs seem safer. We love a good staircase. Let's, uh, let's, uh, let's take the stairs. The stairs, I found the stairs. Gunpowder? I'm... I'm going inside. Alright, alright. This fucking apartment wants us in, in, in fucking side it. We, we, we cannot deny apartment 608, apparently. Alright, I'm going in. I need to. Am I going inside? Really? Really? I will. <laughs> I just noticed it now, and it's awful. Okay, so we, we, we picked Say It Out Loud before, and that's where we realize that we are, or the camera is, the camera has taken over. Uh, we, we have no will of our own. Um, we'll, we'll keep it to ourself, uh, this time, just to, you know, pick different, uh, options here. No, forget it. Yeah, that's crazy talk, cameraman. That's crazy talk. I'm only doing this to gather as much footage as possible. I was told that was important once. Gunpowder? I'm going in. All right, there's the, uh, the shattered TV again. Oh, okay, we, we can't look out the peephole this time. Okay, and all right, let, let, let's just do it. I will, I will, oh, wait. Oh, okay. There we go. There we go. I wonder if we're going to get a different ending or if this is the same. There's Walter. Esteemed viewers, good night. Today we'll have a special broadcast in our show. If you are seeing this, I believe it is already too late. Their lenses have become our eyes, all we see. I understand the enthusiasm to search for more, to learn more, but you know what happened to me when I did the same. Why did you go down this path? Well, it doesn't matter. You've reached the truth, viewer, and it has a price. We don't need to fully pay it, though. We don't need to subject ourselves to this. Listen, they have no control over this. Not yet. Turn the video off. Go away. Do not come back. You'll slip through their fingers. The greatest of rebellions. Go away. Do not come back. Well, fuck. All right, yeah, that, that that was definitely a different ending. VHS is Community TV's exclusive property. Oh, 
All right, uh, uh, fucking teleform, everyone. We we've gotten three endings. Yeah, I guess we shouldn't go back then. You know, um, that that that's also kind of like a damning like. It m makes me think of a. Uh, like uh, gamers that are like completionists that need to like 100% games to get like everything to see everything and literally it's like what I've been doing in this game getting like uh, three endings so far just just stop you fucking weirdo just just that is enough um <laughs> oh okay I, I I think we're done then yeah we we've unlocked everything and uh, just for fun, let's let's watch the uh, the trailer for what I'm assuming is uh, is the full game that this is a uh, proof of concept for. Drowned Lake. has not been seen since we had a chance to speak with the mother. Do you personally believe that there's something sinister hiding in there? No, of course not. People love ghost stories, but in the end, they're just stories. Just stories. Just stories. Just stories. Just stories. Like, after playing uh, Teleform here, this is like a fucking... Drone Lake is going to be like a day one fucking purchase. Like... Like, this game is so fucking cool and weird and it... It... And it's actually brave enough not to fucking explain, like, anything. Like, who brought the tape? Well, I don't know. In this secret ending, some guy called the Operator. Who's the operator? Eh. Like, what? What? What's actually on the tape? Where was the tape shot? Eh. What's going on with the uh, the multiple timelines? Eh. Just, just shit. Just. Eh. The game's like, no, no answers. Stop fucking playing. Stop fucking playing the game. <laughs> All right, all right. Um, so yeah, as we got, we 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 uh, unlocked everything. So uh, three endings. Um, although I am, I I am still kind of curious. Uh, there there's probably like different, because there's still a whole lot of like dialogue options we never did. But um, I think uh, it wouldn't affect uh, you know, the ending or whatever. <laughs> 